everyone. For our writing today, I thought it would be fun to write about our chores, just like Jack did in the story. So go ahead and go to your Unit 9 magazine. Go to page 32 and 33, and we're going to draw the chores that we do at home, and then we're going to write about them. So I was brainstorming when I was a kid some of the chores I had to do and the chores I still have to do as an adult. So I drew some pictures of four different chores that I do. So number one, I pull weeds because I have a lot of weeds that grow at my house and I have to pull them. I actually did that yesterday. I pulled all the weeds and watered my garden. So I should have written water in there, but I just wrote pulled weeds. Um, I clean the room, put all my clothes away, make sure everything's tidy, looks nice. So that's cleaning the room. Cleaning the bathroom, because sometimes the sink gets dirty, sometimes the bathtub needs to be cleaned. So that's me cleaning the bathroom. And then, uh, <laughs> this is something we have to do if we have dogs. We gotta clean up the dog poop. So I drew a picture of me cleaning up dog poop, even though it's not my favorite chore, but you have to do it if you have dogs. And then I wrote about my chores. Make sure we have capital letters and periods. Here we go, so I said, I can pull weeds. I can clean my room and, I should say, and my bathroom. I'm gonna fix that. I can pick up dog poop. Ew! Because it makes me feel gross. So it's right to tell about chores you do. So draw your pictures about chores you do at home, ways you can help out. Maybe you help with dishes, maybe you help take care of brothers or sisters, maybe you help walk the dogs. What are some chores you do at home draw pictures and write about them. Make sure you have capital letters and periods. And I will see you for math. Bye. Or no, nope, we already did math. We are done. Good job. After you do this, you are done. Have a great rest of your day. Bye.